Hello and welcome back. We are following James Kidd, who stopped this time. Last time he did not stop at all, and I had to go running after him. Which I'm sure you saw if you're on this video, so I'll shut up. Anyway, this is the makings of mystery. We're gonna go find some mysterious little... Ruins, I guess? Looks like an old dungeon. What do you think? What do I think? Wait, was he? Now he's dead, so I guess not. Probably up to a building. Are we gonna open these chests? I mean, I guess they're locked. I mean, if it's locked, what can I do? From what I knew of the cast, I wouldn't be surprised to find eclectic instruments of torture and, and probably a lot of guns. Or a That's the only thing I know about him is he had guns. Hair of anguish. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, like I said, it just went up to a house, and there is a dead guy there. Another nice way to kick off. But that is some damn fine. Yeah, it is. Well, I'm surprised they actually locked that up. Like, wouldn't they want to loot the stuff off him? I guess he was still alive, but uh, this might not be his house. I guess. They've been sent to kill these four targets. Four targets. Hey, that's the map I sold to Governor Torres in Havana. He said it marked the location of assassin encampment. Oh. You think maybe you owe them a bit of warning then? If you have any kind of heart beating in that chest. I suppose I could. If it leads me to the four other keys. I mean, I'm a pirate. Bad excuse is better than none at all. So I guess Kid is the voice of reason that we shouldn't be completely evil. So, what is this? You should really tell me what these things are. Okay. I'm gonna put the thing on it. Templar hunt, gain money, medium. Templar hunt, gain money, medium. I guess he's just a bunch of Templar hunts. So that's a lot in one place. This place is hard. Can I not open any of these chests? Okay, there's one in here I can open. That's good. Just this one with glowing stuff coming out of it. Boom. Okay, never mind all of these other chests. What about this massive one? Do they not think the keys could be in here or something? No real indication on it not being the case. Whatever. Get the Templar hunts to get the keys and unlock the Templar armor. One out of five keys required. Or acquired, rather. Right, well, let's get out of here. I can't run for some reason. Like, I can only go this speed. I guess because they don't want you jumping off the walls like you usually do. And then boom! Instant. Instant speed boost. Okay, so I guess this is just my new house. Or at least it should be. I own this place. So. Oh, this is the house I was at earlier, isn't it? Right? I guess not. I guess it's just built similar. In a similar way. Like this little wall here. Seemed like the place where I was shooting targets. But I guess not. That was... I'm dumb. That was off in like Havana or whatever. What is this? Jump! And... Neck broken. Awesome. Well, there's a box over here. I don't know what that's about. What is this? Bam. I got a medal, times three. Cool. Alright, well I guess it's off to go hunt some Templars now and get that armor. I'm assuming the armor is a requirement. Assuming, but who knows, for sure. I think the observatory is the only actual thing that I'm looking for. So where's the big ship that I, like, took over? I guess they just ran away and we just let them. Whatever. It's not like I wanted a bigger ship or anything. Leaving already. I think this cove suits you best, Edward. Better than that costume. Don't Thanks for the compliment. Come on now, we're pirates, kid. We take as we please and become who we like. So yep, that's what a pirate is. But that look ain't you. It's not who you are. Uh, who am I then? It's not untrue. Hard to tell some days. All I know is you like dangerous prizes. Like the observatory. I think you know more about that than you let on in NASA. You noticed that, did you? Yep. 
I didn't. I didn't notice that at all. Sorry, I'm being quiet. Just I'm trying to listen to what the plot is. Since I kind of felt like the last few videos, I was not paying attention to the plot enough, and now I have no idea what's going on. But hey, mission complete. I did a thing. But uh, I need to talk more too. I can't just let them talk over it. But I also just didn't have anything to really comment on. I have no idea what is going to happen. Meet with your crew to purchase available upgrades for Edward's hideout. Okay. So I guess this place is my new house. That's cool. Why I need it is beyond me. I guess I can store stuff here. But, I mean... I thought I had to go over here, but I guess not. Why are they cheering? Oh, the upgrade guy is over here. Okay. I really wish he didn't climb over every little thing. Hey man, how's it going? Okay. Why is there no subtitles for this guy? Okay, so he needs stuff. Unlocks the harbor master. Okay. I have enough gold for that. Harbor master, there you go. I guess it's now this just exists, just instantly was built. Okay. What do you be needing today? What do you be needing today? Great line. Great voice. Okay, I can upgrade stuff. Don't have enough money for upgrades. I only have a thousand gold. I do not know what he's saying. With a little coin encouragement, I could have the old place Bristol fashion and a flower rum. I don't know what he's saying at all. Oh, he wants a tavern. Okay. Sorry, buddy. I don't have enough gold for that. Why we need gold to build stuff is beyond me. I guess for trading, but we're pirates, so we would just steal the wood, wouldn't we? For an old salt. I'll not play duck and drake with you, Captain. I need coin to build a little emporium. I need gold apply. to build a little wood. A local shop would bring in Should probably turn up the volume or something. Locks the general store. Sure. I mean, we're not going to get any people to buy from there because the only people coming here is us. This is not an official village or anything. But whatever. No, well, I guess it's just for me, anyways. I better get some of the profit, though. Or at least a discount. I own the place. Whatever. Take the wheel. Sail to sea. Yes. You are currently ranked blah 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 in the most prosperous pirates. Thanks for just putting my information out there. Jeez. Hey, I don't judge you. We found a trove of nautical maps and ledgers and okay. scattered about the village. You'll find them sorted in the captain's quarters of the jackdaw. Quality stuff. Nautical maps. Okay. I mean, yeah. Might come in useful. Decide build up a fleet? That would be really cool. Have a look for yourself. I can have like several boats like going alongside me and just helping me fight and stuff. That'd be really cool. Don't see it happening though because I would end up shooting them. Access fleet. Okay, maybe it will happen. It'll probably just be for like massive battles, but you know. Okay, trading missions. Alright. First business. Spaniards are thirsty. Set sail for St. Augustine. Bring five bottles of good wine to the old village. Be careful. The merchants there can be impulsive dealers. I don't know what that means, but all right. Let's see what else there is. I guess that's it, actually. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do it. Ship departed. Wait, what? Was it my ship, or? Well, I actually already have other ships. I don't recall ever recruiting people. No. Um. He's in a mission. Salvage the ship? No. Oh. Success! Okay. I got 50 gold. Cool. I got a city unlocked. That's... Set up battle. Selecting a hazardous route. They are not telling me anything. Well. Um... Guess I'll send Sconer Sconer Brig. Okay, so this I did collect the ship. It just 
it just went into my fleet. It didn't become my main ship for whatever reason. I would rather have a big ship. Whatever. Alright, so... Diplomacy or good deed? Um... What gives me more? Odds of success... Uh, let's go with this one. That's what, nine minutes? Five minutes. Good deed. I guess I can put on both of them, huh? Repair ship with four diamonds. Do I even have diamonds? I guess I do. Yeah, repair the ship. I don't know how I got hurt, but... Probably ran into something. That's what I usually do. Send it here. You know, if these are my ships, then they are probably... Probably running into stuff. Available later. Okay, that's cool. Let's go here, I guess. And ship departed. Alright, I have no other ships to send out. So that's cool. And that's it. I guess that's how you get just money in here. I will probably try to do that off screen from now on. Since that kind of took out like two minutes. Just me messing around with a ship thing that they don't even bother explaining to me. Okay, good thing it loaded because I accidentally pressed fire. We're ready, sir. All right, well, uh, let's head this way, I guess. What's our course today, Captain? It's a fine day for I guess we're going into red waters, boys. I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British. Although, kind of wanted to go after those Templars, but I guess not. I'd be a happy man. Oh well, restricted area. Let's go. What's your aim? Uh, like five out of ten. It's pretty rare that I actually hit anything. No. No one ever plays fair on these seas. Least of all me. Set a course for Tool. I got some rum, guys. Now the guys are back to singing, just because I got some rum. Alright, whatever. Go travel speed. I'm just gonna avoid the big battles for now because I do not feel like I could take this whole place on. Not on this little tiny ship. By the big ship, maybe. I mean, that would make me a bigger target, so I guess not. I guess I would just sink really quick. It's not like I'm really good at this game any either. I don't know what they're singing. But at least they're having fun. Anyways, let's go on a journey to the point. Not entirely sure what the objective is right now. Like I know I'm Edward's looking for the observatory. There's a whale over there. But uh you know, things just keep it kinda keep popping up. So who knows what's gonna happen. I don't. This game's been out for a long time, but I've actually not seen any spoilers, just that it had boats in it. That was pretty much it. That was pretty much the end of my knowledge, is it had boats and it's an Assassin's Creed game. Oh, well, there's a lot of trees on the horizon. I also missed a box back there, but whatever. Whoa, listen to that music. That was not an audio glitch, it just kind of cut out like that. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Are they heading straight towards me? Yep, they are. So we're gonna go fight. Or we're just gonna run. I think we're just gonna run. Because that seems like a big ship. Oh yeah, that's a man of war. It's not moving though. Very giant on land, sir. So I guess I'll just go around it. it. Doesn't seem it seems to have noticed me. I mean, it's line of sight at least, but it's not shooting at me. So I'm just gonna ignore it. Oh jeez. Slow down, guys. Oh man, that was my bad. I am sorry. Speed up. Let's get out of here. Hope that I can escape its line of sight before it becomes hostile. <laughs> Which I seem to do a lot in this game. I feel like that might be a design flaw. What is this? Oh, there are people up there, I guess. People that noticed me and are now like, why is there an enemy ship, a pirate ship, in our area? But they're on land, they can't do anything to me. Also kind of weird that everyone like knows I'm a pirate. Like in a show like One Piece, they like 
put the skulls and crossbones on their ship, which makes it obvious, but I don't have that. In fact, my ship kind of looks pretty normal. Oh, fleet mission success. I guess I have to go down there to collect my, my resources. The money I got for it. Seems like they're only trading missions, which makes me a little like, eh, I don't really want it. Because I need those materials for, like, upgrades. Yeah. I guess I don't really need rum or anything but keeping my crew happy. Diplomacy has succeeded. I'm assuming that's a one and not an I, because there's no way they would make that kind of typo, right? Anyways. Back onto the open sea. And yeah, maybe I should start skipping ahead for these things. Well, though, I'm not really sure how to do that, so. I don't have a proper editor, so there's no way for me to, like, what's going on here. Plus, interesting things like these keep happening. But there's no way for me to, like, separate footage right now. What's going on here? Well, they noticed me. Am I attacking this fortress? That's awesome. Ooh, this doesn't look right. You guys want to fight, huh? Fire the swivels. Why I'm attacking a fortress with a boat beyond me. Oh jeez. They don't notice me, I'm not going to be attacked, right? Oh, turn the boat. Oh, brace yourselves. Okay, that hurt. Fire! I'm getting the distinct feeling I'm not supposed to do this. So, I'm just gonna let myself die. Well, that was my bad. With all those little red dots appearing, I thought, oh, maybe this is what is supposed to happen. No. What? I'm back here at least. I'm actually in a better position to get where I was going than I was before. Am I being attacked? Oh yeah, they see me. They are firing mortars at me. How do I use mortars again? Anyways, break yourselves. They didn't hit me. Oh, there they were. Okay, that was a really long mortar shot. Can I use mortars again? This one? Oh yeah, there it is. Right, well, there is a mission to destroy naval forts, but I don't think my boat's ready for that. I don't think I'm ready for that. Like, you saw what happened, I ran right into the wall. Best I can do is like take out these little things. That's a lot of gunboats. Guys, could you not? I could at the very least do it when I'm not looking through a telescope, because that's kind of scared me. Like, I'm looking at this gunboat, and all of a sudden I hear shouting. I thought I was under attack for a second. Just a split second. And it was like, oh, they're singing again. Anyways, I think that's going to be it for the video, since I seem to have a lot of, a lot of ground to cover. Like, that is a lot of ocean. So I'll see you in the next one, and we will be at the, at the destination by the time the next video starts. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed my seafaring adventure.